How much did you get for that copper, Steve? Are we going halves on it? <laughs> Come, we can rip the rest of that out. It's something a lot. Is it? Um, six two. This ain't going to be enough. Well, no. what does it? Because this is a big one. We're not putting the wardrobe there. We did like other one. We put the wardrobe in this. Yeah, we are just can't. Not really. They they'll argue that. So we need to try and give it without that space. So in the first video, I talked about the drains, and uh, now this has all been opened up. You can see what I'm on about. So historically, for the upstairs ensuite, which is at the front of the house, that's always been the difficult sort of bad sister of the project. Where do we get the drainage? When you're on an end terrace like we were on the previous project, it's easy, you can just go straight out the, the wall. When you're in a mid with a passage, it's a little bit more tricky. So what we've done historically is we've gone out the front of the building and run out round and through the passage, which is acceptable, just doesn't look very good. But a few years ago, we discovered that in uh, the space where the gas pipes were for the old back boiler, if we ripped all of that out, we could drop down into this space, into the floor, into our new drains for these en suites, which will then run out outside and connect onto the main drains. And you can see it's all been knocked through, ready to start.